you. Thank you. Thank you, Derek. <laughs> Thank you, Derek, and thank you to the staff, board, and community of the NAACP, including all of you guys here in this room and everyone at home watching who's devoted their lives and efforts toward supporting people of color. Yeah, yeah, I can do that. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna try to keep this simple because um, tonight is not really about me because the purpose is bigger than me, right? You know, it's not bigger than us together, but it's bigger than me, because my part is a very small part of the work that's being done in this world and the work that is yet to be done. I'm lucky I was able to start the Clara Lionel Foundation in 2012, and if there's any thing that I've learned is that we can only fix this world together. We, we can't do it divided. I cannot emphasize that enough. We can't let the desensitivity seep in. The if it's your problem, then it's not mine. It's a woman's problem. It's a black people problem. It's a poor people problem. I mean, how many of us in this room have colleagues and partners and friends from other races, sexes, religions? Show of hands. Well, then, you know, they want to break bread with you, right? They like you? Well, then, this is their problem, too. So when we're marching and protesting and posting about the Michael Brown Juniors and the Tatiana Jeffersons of the world, tell your friends to pull up. Thank you to the NAACP for all of your efforts to ensure equality for our communities. Thank you for celebrating our strength and tenacity. We have been denied opportunities since the beginning of time and still we prevail. So I'm honored. Imagine what we could do together. Thank you for this honor.